Hey Taurus. All right. So seven of emotions in the reverse starting out that um, I feel like you're letting your blessings pass you by. You're definitely seeing illusions instead of really seeing the truth. Uh, you have the high priestess here in the reverse also letting you know that you're not um, really utilizing your intuition. You really are discerned. You know how to go within, but you're not really doing that because you're just in a way grabbing every opportunity that comes your way and or missing out on the blessings that's already in front of you. But you have the eight of materials here signifying that you're going to be putting that work and not only for your stability but maybe that internal work as well so you can really see things in a different perspective um and with that comes the empress yeah spirit is going to be really helping you and manifesting with you and genuinely um assisting you in whatever you need assistance in whether it's help for yourself help for others whatever it may be um, you have the death card in the reverse and the nine of emotions in the upright. So spirit is letting you know like, yeah, a change is going to happen. A death and a rebirth is going to happen in order for you to be emotionally fulfilled here with the nine of emotions. You know, you have all of your wishes fulfilled, but that change needs to happen. You're probably still in your cocoon, not ready for the rebirth just yet, but it's going to happen. And with that comes the three of emotions. So people really connecting with you and supporting you, your true soul tribe, those that really want to see you win and succeed. Um... You have the four voices here signifying, yeah, that rest and rejuvenation is necessary. Gaining that clarity about who it is that's already around you or what it is that you need to do in order to gain your ultimate happiness and stability. And that's what's going to come. You have to really face your fears here. You have the queen of materials, the moon card in the reverse, and the sun card. So yeah, you will be the ultimate boss that you need to be running your own businesses, having the ultimate stability, you know, not penny pinching and not wanting for nothing, but you have to face your fears and put yourself out there. And now you understand that you know really getting rid of that dead weight and accepting what it is at face value is really going to bring you your happiness five of materials in the reverse signifying that yeah you're no longer going to you're no longer going to be left out in the cold you're no longer going to be penny pitching and having to you know scramble for money basically it's fated for you to win here with the world cosmos it's fated for you to succeed it's fated for you to really reap exactly what it is that you sow and you're putting the work in you know spirit is just saying hey wake up stop you know being delusional and stop feeding into the illusions so with that comes new partnerships you know new love for yourself but you know definitely like i say a part of your soul tribe people that are going to be really connected with you in relationships and, and you know in friendships um you have the night of emotions here and the emperor card so now that you have that new love because i know you guys love love once you have that support and that love you're going to be feeling that emitting that energy wearing your heart on your sleeve and really just feeling a love for all of the your new passion projects and also your new friends and soul tribes that's coming in and the emperor here letting you know that you are a leader you are a boss like i said you are abundantly happy uh, um, abundantly blessed you are goal-oriented business-minded so continue to put yourself out there good job taurus